All right, so today is June 18th of 2023. And just a real quick little update. I've been working on planking the starboard side here. <clears throat> and I started here at frame 24. And earlier today, I finished up the very aft section of this, so I've got half of it done now. This was a little bit challenging back here again, as the the ends of the boat seem to be. There's a little more curve curve coming up back here, and and uh, yeah. So what I did was I made this first piece. I did this yesterday, and uh, cut it at all the proper angles. And then I did some filling in here because I had a little bit of a gap in there, but it's it's sitting on the on the the build stringers, but uh, it left a gap in order to keep things more. I, you know, I could have taken those build stringers down a little more and got rid of this gap here, but then it would have put a, a more severe curve on here, and I didn't want that. So, I think what wound up happening was I think I actually, when I was doing the the frames, the bottoms of the frames in the chine point here, I think I probably cut this down just a little bit more than I should have when I was planing it and whatnot. And so it gave me a little bit of a, a curve in at this tip here. So, yeah, but it turned out all right. Um, and as you can see, again, I had to, to taper several of these boards to, to get them to come in. There's one there, one there. And then this was the last board that I put in. And I did that earlier today, and I'm waiting for that uh, epoxy, that thickened epoxy to set up before I put the last few screws in here. But yeah, it went all right. Uh, like I said, it was a bit of work getting these this this aft end here to flow smoothly, but it, I think it's I think it's fine. One other thing I've been working on a little bit, and I'm going to have to go up here and show you what I'm been doing. This is a bit of a journey, but come in here, get on the tank, walk across the tank, hunched over, Now, this here is going to have to come down to here at some point. So this here is, is all going to have to be cut out. But I don't have that done for now. And then here's the steps. Going down to the aft cabin. And as you can see, this is all sealed up now. Yeah, bathroom over there, shower here, one bed there, the other bed's going to go, go in over here. But what I wanted to show you was this here. Um, I've got an access hatch cut out, and I actually made the, boy that's pretty dark isn't it? I actually made the trim work. set you down for a second I actually made the trim work there I actually made the trim work to go around it to support the hatch I've been epoxy coating it so it's sitting up setting up right now but here's my access to the bilge back here where the shaft comes out. And you can see the shaft opening there, the shaft log. And I did uh, manage to get this, I think I mentioned something about that. I didn't have this totally smooth and I wasn't sure how I was going to go about doing that. I did manage to get that done before I sealed the bottom of the boat up. So that should be easy enough to get my my uh, my bearing and seal in there, whatever I decide to go with in that respect. And I also got this hose here kind of in place. 
and this is going to go to the drain for the shower here which is actually going to go into this removable hatch cover so I'll have to put the drain down in, in, in here somewhere so we'll have a drain in the middle of this hatch cover yeah so we'll see how that works but yeah I'll have to get everything coated inside here and I don't know if I'm going to go ahead and I'll put the copper naphthenate in there and I don't know if I'll do anything else if I'll epoxy coat it then or paint it or what I'll do but I'm going to have to probably pull up s several of these here too so I can get at the wood underneath here to get it coated but uh, yeah it shouldn't be too big of an issue but yeah it's it's really it, it seems different now <laughs> you know with the with the planking on here and I could theoretically start doing more work in here too now now that the planking's on I could start building up the the, the sides and the ends of, of the bunks here but I don't think I'm going to get too worried about that just yet so anyway that's that's really all I have today I don't have a whole lot else going on